guys, welcome back to another video today. Um, sorry I missed the video this Thursday. I wasn't able to film on Wednesday and there's also nothing going on. But, if you can see back there, we're getting preparations ready for uh, drilling in oats. Uh, we got most of it disc. My dad's getting in 966 with the disc to go disc uh, little section. I didn't have time to disc before. Um, and then my grandpa's going with the 606 and he's dragging the whole thing. Leveling it all out. And then we're going to... I can't remember if we're going to pack it and then drill or if we're going to drill then pack. But, yeah, we're starting to get stuff done. But, yeah, he's driving back there. So, yeah, should be cool. yesterday um yeah apparently it's a heifer I thought it was a boy just looking through the fence but my dad saw it peeing out the back so I guess it's a heifer but yeah there it is and if you're wondering why we didn't go up there and see it's because she will kill you if you're not looking She's, she's trying to intimidate me when I'm on the other side of the fence right now. Uh, yeah, she just doesn't like people around her calves. She doesn't like people even if she doesn't have a calf. Sonia, what'd you bury? Hey, what'd you bury? You got dirt all over your nose. You buried something right here. Alright, I'll leave it be. So, I'll try and put it in perspective how much you put in oats. Well, bottom of voice crack. So, this is already hay. Well, you put in oats and alfalfa, and then the oats grow up first, and then you bell the oats, and then the alfalfa starts growing in all the grass, but you get the point. So, over there, there's a post somewhere in there. We're, we're putting in oats from there, all the way to that fence, all the way over to this corner, and then all the way down in here. Yeah, I wish I had a drone to where I could show you guys, but I am not into YouTube that much yet. I don't need a drone. Uh, that's off the roof of the barn. I don't want to touch this because this will, this will make my hands itchy. Uh, fiberglass. Uh. Okay, let's go. Are we very still? With the fiberglass. And yeah, yeet. Yeah, so that's what's going on today. Um, yeah, nothing else really, because there's nothing else really to do. And there's nothing, well, I guess there's stuff to do. We gotta put in a fence sometime for the goats. I don't know if we'll do that today, we might not. If we, our thing is, is that it's supposed to rain tomorrow. But it's kind of wet today, because it's been. It's a little wet and starting to dry up. It's pretty cold. So let's get like 50 today and it's like 40. My hands are cold. Granted, I don't have gloves on, but uh, yeah. So the drill's sitting right here, nice and pretty. Waiting for her debut. Got a tube in the tire, I think is what we did. Cause uh, we of course, one of the tires is flat. We take it to someone to repair it. They like pass you or something, bring it back, fill it up with air, put it back on there, and it's flat again. Oh, still to pay that bill, unfortunately. But yeah, goats, they're doing goat things, which is pretty much just screaming. Uh, not much, not nothing new there. Uh, yeah, I'm 
waiting for them to get on faster. So I gotta trim mom's hooves. I gotta trim Stella's hooves. Um, cause hers, uh, when we first got the goats, we thought they were kind of like cows with their hooves. Like they kind of just grow and they can be fine most of the time. Uh, no, these things are sitting and they're like curling up. It's, it's weird. So I gotta cut all that out before they're out here. I don't have to do it before they're out here, but it makes more sense. Um, you kidding me? Buddy in the 966 just left hay out here. Can't trust him for saying that. Yeah, as you can see, we got the post in for the fence there and the uh, uh, bar on top. I gotta get some gloves on, but yeah. Tatum! 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 Jane! Willie! Waylon! Why are you looking at me like that? You guys always look so confused. Alright, well. I'm gonna go do something. Uh, probably won't be much, because I gotta. My hand's cold. I need to get cold, huh? Yeah, goats. Whoa, don't drop the camera, Rick. Goats are good. Is that water frozen? Is there water frozen? Oh, no, it wasn't. It isn't. Goats are good. I had to raise that thing up. It used to that, where it used to be hanging from like down there. Raised it up to there, drill a hole, and spun the thing in. The eye bolt. Strictly, I did that because I'm tired of them doing that, getting up there, but they can still do that. Because eventually one of the times they're going to rip the netting because they get their hooves up there. You shouldn't just hide eight in this. I don't know what to do with them. They poop in the bunk, which I'm hoping that'll stop once they're out on pasture. Because then they have. Because right now, these guys just have a little area out there. Then they have this. And they're going to be eating a lot. I mean, there's a more likely chance of them pooping in the bunk when they have a little pen than it is when they have a big pen to go wherever they want. If you get what I'm saying. But yeah, those are good. For Sonya? Huh? Okay. He's such a weirdo. So what that uh, drag is doing, it's breaking up all these big clumps of dirt. And it, it's pretty, it's pretty dry, this is a pretty wet chunk, but they're breaking up pretty good. And it, it's leveling it. It's, I mean, it's not really leveling, but it's pulling dirt from here and it's dragging it all over the place. So it's spreading the dirt kind of everywhere. And yeah, you're pulling up all these, all the corn stalks out of the, the ground too. That mostly was when you're disking, but with this, it's got a bunch of little uh, prongs, really, I guess is what you could call them. And it's going, and they're going across the ground and picking up stuff. It's, yeah, almost done. And then, yeah, so next year we'll have that ground, and all this over here, that will be for either corn or beans, so, yeah. Back too, it's as you can see, it's not a disc, but kind of looks like it. 
because you can see these rows kind of that's because the back roll there's sections that kind of dig up and that's going to help break up those dirt chunks too which is good because you need when we're planting you want it to be nice and fluffy no dirt chunks yeah that's like what you want when you're planting so it'll work good She's laying down. Let's go. Let's go drill some oats. Bye, Lucy. Bye, Sonia. Bye, Lucy. Bye, Sonia.
Well, I guess we had a breakdown. Well, not I guess. We did have a breakdown. But we got the big plot done. Uh, got rain tomorrow, so you might not be able to finish the rest up today. But we're going to try. So thanks for watching today's video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Thank you.